How's it going everybody? This is RBT coming at you with my Fiesta Bowl prediction. And personally, I believe this is going to be the most exciting bowl game aside from the national championship. Of course, I got some bias there, but I still think this is going to be an extremely good game. People were all talking about how at one point these teams were wanting to probably going to play for the national championship. I believe these were the best two teams in the country. Both lost the game and lost the chance of playing the title. But here they are matched up. People were always saying, who's going to win out of these two if they play for the title? Now we're finally going to see that this isn't a national championship game, but it's a BCS game, so it's a huge stage, huge venue. This game's played in Arizona at the, I think it's the Arizona Cardinal Stadium. So, it's going to be a great game, and it's, I mean, two absolutely just insane offenses. Kansas State with Colin Klein, uh, John Hubert, just great team. You got Oregon, DeAnthony Thomas, Kenyon Barner, Mar Marcus and Mariota, and it's just going to be a great game, and I think it's going to be a very high-scoring affair. And I guess I can go ahead and tell you my prediction. I'm predicting Oregon 41-34 to over Kansas State. With that said, the reason why, because when you look at Kansas State's schedule, you try to find a team on there that best resembles the style that Oregon plays. And when you look at that, most of the teams... Not all of them, but most of the teams Kansas State plays are not necessarily pro style, but they don't run any type of offense as explosive as Oregon's. But the one team that stands out that does is Baylor. And Baylor beat Kansas State by 20 something points and made Kansas State look like a Division II team. They absolutely ran all over them. Nick Florence had a heck of a game. Colin Klein struggled, and that's not. Um, that's not a uh, hit like the defense's fault, but from what I'm comparing, but he still struggled in that game. You could say that's a big reason why, but I st still don't think Kansas State has enough speed, has enough athleticism to match up with a team as fast as Oregon. Because if a team like Baylor can do it, Oregon has way better athletes, extremely more skilled players than Baylor, and if can if Baylor can do it, Oregon can definitely do it. Don't get me wrong, Kansas State is an absolutely magnificent team, the most well-coached team in the country. I mean, they, like I said, they don't have the great talent. Only player that I can think of off the top of my head, Kansas State fans may agree with me, disagree with me because I'm not, so don't know every little thing about Kansas State, but the one player that pops out of my head that's only, well, two players that pop out of my head is NFL caliber players is Arthur Brown and Colin Klein possibly John Hubert, but he's a little small, but, I mean, this is a team compiled of JUCOs because Kansas State doesn't get the cream of the crop. Bill Snyder gets the JUCOs and coaches them up. They play as a team. They don't make mistakes. They're fundamentally sound in special teams, and they play field position at times if they have to. Colin Klein come at break a run or two, so it's going to be a fun game to watch, but when it comes down to town alone and comparing teams, I think... Oregon has the edge by a touchdown, 41-34. to 34. Both teams will score many points. Both defenses aren't great by any means, but it's going to be a high-scoring game. It's gonna, uh, fireworks are going to be going off, and it's going to be a fun one to watch. Um, DeAnthony Thomas, Kenyon Barner, uh, I mean, it's just too much speed for Kansas State's defense. I mean, you might disagree with me if you're a Kansas State fan, but that's what I believe coming from an unbiased perspective on the game. So let me know what you think of my prediction below. Let me know what your prediction is. Let me know who you think is going to win this game. And let me know what you think the score is going to be. That's my prediction. And, uh, yeah, so subscribe to me if you haven't already. Um, please, uh, like I said, leave a comment. Um, go view my other BCS Bowl predictions. This is probably going to be uploaded either Tuesday or Wednesday. I'm, uplo I'm uploading my Alabama Notre Dame prediction today, which is Monday making all my videos on Monday as always, so subscribe if you haven't already, and um, World Tide Go Sock and Go Titans to you. Have a great day, and I'll see you guys later.